In this video, I will show you how to play Geometry Dash on PC. So let's jump straight into it. So in order to go ahead and play Geometry Dash on PC, you're going to want to download something called Bluestacks, which is an app player. And what I'll do, I'll leave a link in the video description down below where you can click onto that and be taken to a page like this. So what you're gonna to want to do once you come across to here is click to play Geometry Dash on PC. And what it's gonna do is download Bluestacks onto your device. Once that's done, go ahead and click onto the installation wizard to start running the installation wizard for Bluestack. So it might ask you to update as well. So you just wanna go through and install and update this first of all. So once that's all done and all the updates are done, you'll see what's gonna happen is going to load up Bluestacks automatically. And once that's finished loading through, you're going to get a screen like this. Now it's going to come up with a pop-up, so make sure you download it through the link in the video description down below. And then all you need to do is press the blue install from Google Play button down here. And what it's going to do is go ahead and install this onto the app player. So as you can see, Geometry Dash is now installed. So what you can do is come up to the top left hand corner, press the home button up here to be taken to your home screen. And from here, you can go ahead and launch Geometry Dash just by double clicking onto Geometry Dash. Now, what's gonna happen is just gonna take a minute or two to load through. So as you can see, that's currently lo loading through. So it just takes a minute to do this. And here we are in Geometry Dash. So as mentioned, you can connect a gamepad if you want to, but if not, you can just go ahead and play with the keyboard as per normal. So you just basically use the arrow keys and the space key to jump. So you can just go through and play this as normal. And that is how to go ahead and play Geometry Dash on PC. So I hope this tutorial did help you out today. And if it did, I would really appreciate it if you was to consider dropping down below the video, leaving a like, and also subscribing to the channel. With that being said, I just want to take a minute to thank you guys for watching this quick tutorial and I will see you in the next video.